Hi there! Today in the Street Food Channel we will do a traditional Danish hot dog with a red sausage and the famous Danish remoulade sauce. So let's get going! I'm using traditional Danish red sausage uh, but it might be difficult for you to get hold of those. And again, that the color doesn't give anything to the taste. It's just for the for the look, nothing else. And of course, it's nice that it matches uh, the Danish flag. As these sausages are pre-cooked, I only have to heat them in some hot water. But again, you could also use fried sausages. Let's make the remoulade sauce. So now for the ingredients. First of all, we have the mayonnaise. This one I have bought. You can do it yourself, and I will put up a video to show you how to do that. Um, so the next one are the pickles. Again, you can do your pickles yourself, but that will take several weeks. Then we have caper, the big ones here I'm using, a couple of them. Salt and pepper, then you have yogurt, and then the spices. You have curry, you have turmeric, and then you have some sugar. We start with chopping the pickles. Then the capers. How fine you want to chop up the vegetable depends on how much bite and crunch you want. Now here I am with my mayonnaise which I've bought. Uh, I add the yogurt. It's both to make it a little bit more smooth but also to give it some uh, sourness as well. So we are looking for a sauce texture, uh, a little bit like this. In goes the pickles and the caper. Then the spices, the curry, and the turmeric. This, this is only for the color, nothing else. And then finally some sugar. You probably had to adjust this afterwards. So in this case I didn't get it yellow enough. I have so a little bit more turmeric. And there you go. Now we start to see the real nice yellow color that Ramonelle should have. And finally we adjust it with a little bit of salt and pepper. And there you go. Your remoulade is ready. Nice one. Okay, now that you, we have done the remoulade sauce, it's time to put the hot dog together. Here I'm using my own hot dog buns and I have a link right here how you also can do them at home. They are really simple and they are much more delicious than the one you buy. Then we start with uh, adding the remoulade sauce. Now there's no uh, religion around what to start with. Uh, I mean, I just start with the remoulade because it gives a nice uh, surface to, to build upon. Then we put on the pickles. And I have to admit, I have bought this one. Um, yep, I'm a sinner, what to say. After that, I will add uh, some roasted onions. Now, some other normal toppings would be uh, ketchup, mustard, and raw onions as well. And finally, we have a very traditional Danish hot dog with a red sausage. What a beauty. Cool. Now you learn to do a real Danish hot dog with a red sausage and remoulade sauce, of course. Should we give it a taste? I can hardly wait. I mean, this is this is childhood for me, right? Going to the sausage wagon and having a real hot dog with a red sausage and, and remoulade. Oh my god! Let's give it a try. Hmm. Umami from the sausage, sweetness, sourness from the remoulade, the weird sauce that just so damn delicious, 
crumbs from the roasted onion and then finally the pickles on top of it and a very soft bread remember to see how i did the hot dog breads in the other video um yeah this is this is just fantastic so now the question of course what do you drink to a traditional danish hot dog well i'll show you Don't say it's just the American that are weird. The Danes can be really, really weird as well. Cheers, see you next time. All the best. <laughs>